Rainmaker makes it easy to take attendance. Whether you want to add attendance by barcode, do it manually, or do it by a class roster. We're going to talk about doing it by the class roster now. Let me explain. The first thing we need to do is set up a class schedule in Rainmaker. So we're going to go to Settings and Classes. On this screen, you'll notice that I already have a lot of classes that I've put in here. And I need to add a new one. I'm going to add a Wednesday class, my advanced class. My advanced class starts at 6.45 on Wednesday p.m. And the class is a junior class. And it's advanced belts. So I've got my junior advanced. And the class description is uh, red belt and up. Ages 6 to 12 and I'm gonna hit add. And you'll notice now that my Wednesday 645 class, Junior, has been uh, put there. I can easily rearrange the order by dragging and dropping. Let me put that right back where it was because that's where it needed to go. And it instantly saves it. I can also click on the class and edit this class. All I do is click the link. I can edit the class. It's actually 6 to 14. And hit save and instantly now that information has been updated. So what I want to do now is I want to uh, search for a student of mine named Tyler. And Tyler has an uncanny resemblance of Justin Bieber. But anyways, I want to put just uh, Tyler here in, uh, in a class. So I'm going to scroll all the way down to Assign Classes. And I'm going to assign him the, uh, the Wednesday Junior Advanced class. So I click Assign the Class button. And if we scroll back down, you'll notice that he is indeed a part of that. I can also remove him from that class by clicking the delete link. Uh, he's also part of our Hyper Pro training on Saturdays. I'm going to assign that class. The good thing about Rainmaker is you can put unlimited uh, classes, unlimited rosters, if you will, uh, per student. So there we go. We got that done. So now what am I going to do with this? Well, let me go to student attendance. Let me add attendance and let's do it by a class roster. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to select a day. It's going to be that, uh, let's see, a Wednesday. And then in the Wednesday, I want to select the Junior Advanced class. And I'm going to hit Go. And it creates my roster. All the students that are assigned to this class is going to show up. It's easy for me to mark him attended. I just click Mark Attended. And it's done. He's already been assigned that class. If I made a mistake, it's easy to correct my mistake. I just click that he didn't attend that class. Let me tell you what went on in the background. When I click Attended, it added a class to his um, classes since last exam. It also subtracted a class credit if he is on a class credit program. And it also marks him as last attended today just by clicking that one button. You can imagine if I have five or six or 20 people in the class, it would be easy just to click, 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 click. You can also use the same application maybe on an iPad or a tablet. So that way on the floor, you could easily just Call roll call and mark them attended right then. Let me explain to you what happens when I click not attended because maybe I made a mistake. What happened just now is it added a class credit back to him. It also went back to the previous date that he attended classes as well as it deleted the attendance record for him. It did that automatically. You didn't have to think about that. Let's say that I would rather, let, uh, let's go back to let's say Monday and my Monday classes show up, a uh, little champs class. Let's click that. I've got two people in there. And um, what I want to do is I want to print out this roster. So I hit the print view. And now what I can do is I can take their attendance right from there. So that's beautiful as well. So if you want to write on the floor, have a printed sheet, and then mark them, and then later on go into Rainmaker and click mark attended, you can do it as well. Okay, so the next step, uh, attendance, reports. MIA reports by roster. So let's say the date is the 20th. Uh, let's try the 16th here. And I click go and it's a Monday little champs class. Let me run the report. The person that didn't show was Aiden. He didn't show up for that class. So I have his parents' names, his address if I want to send him a miss you postcard, uh, the home phone, the mobile phone, and the last class is on the 12th. So now easily I can print this if I need to. Uh, and hand it to one of my instructors to make my MIA calls. Uh, or I can just work right from this sheet right here. It's that beautiful. So now you can see out of a class roster 
who attended and who did not attend that class. All of this is done automatically for you by Rainmaker.